Hey, welcome back to Zelda. Hi. Welcome back. It looks like that was pretty tough. So how'd it go? Uh, Koga was easy. <laughs> Koga was an idiot. Oh wait, dude, she didn't Cobra. know we fought Koga. I see. So to summarize. There's no mistaking that what you all saw was the Demon King from the Legend of the Imprisoning War. Now you your sister didn't know it's you cracking the, the gold over the coins! you've been seeing was actually an imposter. it's gonna do that again. And the reason she appeared at Hyrule Castle was so the Demon King could lure you into a trap. I knew something was weird. Wield. Wield. I mean, Princess Zelda not doing anything to help with those troubles everywhere in the kingdom. But it's all connected. The upheaval... The problem, our homelands have been facing the fake princess. She's a faker. It's all happening because the Demon King is back. So that means that Princess Zelda isn't actually here. Instead, she's in the distant past and not in the present, right? Yes, we should consider that to be the case, bizarre as it sounds. It also seems that Zelda was trying to somehow defeat the Demon King in the past. Oh, so oh he's walked oh, yeah. to Jojo. It's down Jojo. Himself. Yeah, I forgot until just that moment. They swore that when the Demon King was revived, the descendants would awaken the sages and fight alongside them. <laughs> You're talking normally. Oh wait, I have a character to play. But with Princess Zelda <laughs> in the past, we can't ask her what the plan is supposed to be. And she can't be here to fight with us either. We also don't know anything about the Demon King other than the fact that he's bad news and super strong. You don't say. What do we do? Huh. Besides that on what you each told me. It appears the princess was making preparations in anticipation of the Demon King's revival. There must be some hint that we still haven't figured out. Right you are! We cannot afford to stand <laughs> still at a time such as this. It is imperative that we act. Jojo! Right, well, without laughing? any leads... Be professional. Me, why am I laughing? You're at work, be professional. Oh, oh, wait! You said that six sages were with the king when he fought against the Demon King uh, during the imprisoning war, right? So we need an extra sage. We're missing Wind, one. Fire. Water. Where's Earth? Lightning. It's spirit. We're it's missing Earth. Earth. And time. That was the princess. No, princess is light. Nice oh. try, stupid. I see. It's spirit. What do you see? That's it. There's one more sage back then. It's not the bird, it's not the Goron, it's not the... Fish. Fish, sorry. And it's not the Gerudo. And it's not the Zelda. It's that one, the Zonai. The... It's the Zonai the Sage. The Minoru. The Sage of Zonai, Magic Max. Spirit. Exactly. One more Sage that might be here now. I'm sure this is the lead we're hoping for. It will be well, it will be well worth our while to search. Each of you awakened the sages at ruins from the Age of Legends, right? Maybe the remaining sage is in a similar location. That makes sense. So we should search major ruins from the Age of Legends. There's good a place to, as any to start. If we just searched all of Hyrule randomly, we'd probably never find the sage. All right, we big. have a plan. Let's split up and let's split up the work and get to it. Oh no! You four go back to your homelands and gather info about ruins that might be related to the sage. Linky, search around and see if you can find any other undiscovered leads. Yeah, Link, just dig around. Everyone's relying on you. Don't let us down. Please put a circle on my map. Go to Kakariko. What? How do you know? Kakari Kakariko? It's because it's the first that time that you go there. Kakariko? They keep talking about these floating rings that Zelda Kakariko? didn't allow you to go in. Where is Kakariko at again? Go. Southeast. Are you yeah. right, Drew? So. Yeah, it's right there, Kakariko. <gasps> Kaker okay, yeah, Kakariko, Kakariko, Kakariko. I only said that because in Ocarina of Time, it's in the southeast. That's the only reason why it said yeah, that yeah. on the map. I think. No, Kokiri like, is. Kokiri in Ocarina of Time, is, it's in the north. It's like east. It's right, right next to the castle on the east. You're right. <laughs> You're right. Hang on. Yeah, it goes castle. Then I just got lucky. It goes castle, Kakariko, Zora, Kokiri, Gerudo. West and I just is got the lucky. lake, and then west is the lake. Okay, go talk to Impa or Paya. I mean, and where was she at again? Uh, by the gate, right? No, she'll be by the ring floating in the air. Oh god, we gotta collect rings. That thing? Actually, yeah. we're going to very, very soon. Right there, Impa's uh, Paya on the left. Down? No, Ooh. she's on the ground level. With you. Oh, she's on ground level. Those two. Right oh. I I use her. He said, "Open your sky." I don't know. 
Master Link, good evening. I forgot about that weird guy. Are you thinking about floating the ring, uh, the floating ring, Look Roland? His hair, Drew. Don't you love it? I am as well. It has been on our minds for some time. <laughs> What's the name of the? We would like to suggest resuming. Red the Shark message? guy. Sidon. Tyler's combining Sidon's and Yo 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 Jimbo voice for that guy. Yo Jimbo. <laughs> yeah, 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 Yo Jimbo. Figured out what became of Princess Zelda. Voices for him. What? The Zelda who appeared at the upheaval was the creation of the Demon King. It's. <laughs> and the real Princess Zelda still hasn't been found. It's JoJo's voice with a but dopey sound. How can this be true? <laughs> with, with JoJo. It's such an unbelievable tale, and yet, I trust you completely, Master Link. It must be as you say. Nice hat. It is hard to explain, but the princess we saw was somehow unfamiliar. It was as though her very aura was different. I do like her hat. But if she was an imposter the whole time, that would mean. <laughs> and she was the among real, us? The <gasps> she ordered us to close off the floating ring ruin was. Because the Demon King saw it as a threat, isn't that right? That, game's dead that only means that one joke. thing we should investigate the <laughs> floating ring ruin immediately. You are exactly right. There is no longer any reason to prohibit the research. Let's open up the floating ring ruin at once, Mr. Toro. Knowledge is tugging on the line. Time to reel in some results. <laughs> what? Your Lurlin phrasing is coming through, Mr. Toro. You must really be pleased. Oh, yeah, he's from Lurlin. Aww. It's just, hmm. There's one problem. We still need to determine how to conduct the survey. How come we didn't see you there in Breath of the Wild, huh? It's clear that the interior of this ring is hollow. Sadly, there doesn't seem to be, uh, to be an entrance to you get in. Send. If the contents of the other ring ruins are of any indication, there should be a stone slab inside enga engraved with Zonai script. What? First, we should look for a way to confirm that there's a stone slab inside. However, <laughs> we also don't want to damage these precious ruins. Oh, pardon me. I was lost in thought. I'd better hurry to tell everyone about this so we can open up the ruins. Okay, so you're gonna, you know, dig your way in. I can't remember yeah. if you're supposed to read it or take a picture, so just do both. But you are to ascend, right? Yeah. I guessed right. Now, little ready. dipwad science dude. Will... <laughs> dipwad? Jeez, man. That would be Was so rude. Was there something rude. you said that you didn't like, Tyler? There's this bald guy right here. His name's Calip. And every time you even slightly get close, he would give you a long-ass freaking line of dialogue and teleport you away and, like... A grief time moment? No oh, it does! Yeah. No matter what... No matter how close you get, if you drop a weapon in there because you're being stupid, then you, you literally just, you can't get it back. Like, I was trying to carry something, he interrupted me, it dropped the item in the range of where he talks to you, I could never get it back. Screwed. Nice. It was very upsetting. I tried to sneak around here one time and he still saw me. Yeah, I... Let me guess, right here, huh? On Somewhere the red around. carpet? Oh! Nice enough of them to mark it for me. Okay, so is. read that and take a picture of it, because I'm not sure if you're supposed to show it to Toro or if you're supposed to just tell him what it says. Oh, it oh you can't read it. Okay, yeah, take, a picture. take a picture. He he translates it because it's he can read Zonai text. I assume that was good. There's enough a picture. whole yeah. there's a whole side quest where you're supposed to go around the world and take a. a <gasps> Oh no! <laughs> Tyler, you did that. Oh, you, did. <laughs> you go around all of Hyrule and you take I pictures of all those. About that song. Until you <laughs> I did that. too. It's literally the minute he I said saw, "Around the World." I saw your, face, I saw your my face with the memories came floating back. <laughs> well, but that can't be right. Oh, I forgot I said anything. I must have imagined. You're terrible. What about this? Around the world. What's this you've got? Huh? Could it be? Could it really be? Pio, Kellip, look at this. I'm gonna have that guy's hairline in three years. That's Kellip. Yeah, I'm gonna I have Kellip's like hairline in three I years. I basically won't. Lucky. I don't have any family members that bald. Could this be the interior of the floating ring you ruin? In more? Wow, the stone slab is so yeah. clearly visible. There appear to be Zonai inscriptions on this one as well, just like the other ruins. Toro, if you would. Uh, right, let me see what I can decipher. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Promise Zelda, solemnly signed. Minoru, the sage of. Hide the key. Southeast and trust future. Wish defeat Demon King. That's all I can make out. There's some lettering I can't figure out before Southeast, but Minoru seems to be someone's name. Okay, let's go Southeast. Hmm. Look at the context of Minoru. I do believe this is the first time 
Oh, one of these slabs have put a name to his age. I forgot it's Caliph. I gotta do an annoying voice for him. He also mentioned Zelda and the Demon King. How fascinating. <laughs> Aha, the inscriptions are telling us all sorts of essential information. Why is What's the matter? Quiet? Oh, nothing. It's just the part before the southeast section. I think it says Dragonland. That's where you are. Hmm. Oh, you're right. Paya knows her stuff. This should be read as Dragonland Southeast. Fantastic work, Paya. Oh, thank goodness. I've proven useful. It seems my continued Zonai language studies have paid off. Oh, I'm being upstaged. Oh. <laughs> Where are we? Something about our Dragonland to the Southeast? Hmm, how familiar are you with the Southeast of Hyrule? There's a site in Farron Woods that's long been known as the Zonai Ruins. It predates the ruins brought in from the sky and is home to many ancient relics. If memory serves, there were dragon designs on those ruins that I haven't seen anywhere else. Um, you know not over here. <laughs> oh ho, Kellogg, great catch. The Zonai ruins in Farron. He's got Elwind on his bag. There's a good yeah, chance yeah. that's exactly the po uh, what this is pointing at. That's our Kellogg. Fantastic work. I don't want to go to a ruin. What did you just say? That this inscription is pointing us towards Zonai ruins? Oh. No, not that. The next bit. A certain adjective was used. I believe it started with fan and ended with tastic. What was it again? Uh, fantastic work, you mean? <laughs> hey, yeah, fantastic work. That's what you said. <laughs> yeah. Okay, dude. Caleb, what fantastic work he said? Fantastic. <gasps> Me. I hate this guy. Link, when we put together the script on this stone slab and translate it, we get definite uh, mentions of the Sage Minru, the Demon King, and someone with the same name as Princess Zelda. Something related to all three of them must be waiting at the Zonai Ruins in the southeast. We've landed a real catch here. Thank you for your help, truly. Now we've no time to dawdle. There's research to be done. Okay. Sure. Callop, will you join me? Oh, of course. I would be ahem, ahem, a fantastic addition fantastic, to the team. Fantastic, fantastic, fantastic. Very good. With that settled, let's be off to the Zonai Ruins of Farron. First we head southwest. Then we'll establish a base in the Poplar Foothills at the Skyview Tower by the ruins. Okay. We don't even have that map. Nope. Don't worry, Johanna's going to be getting that. In search of new discoveries. We make for Farron. Whoa. All right. I don't know if you guys remember the dragon ruins, but they're the same as when Breath I, of the Wild. So. No. I don't remember. I'm sure if I see them, I won't remember either. They left, just like that. Well, I'm sure those two will be fine. Who cares about Calip? I must study more about the Zonai civilization, so I don't fall behind Toro and Calip. Yes, it seems somewhat frivolous next to the mystery of the real Princess Zelda's whereabouts. I don't doubt that she is safe and well, but I must believe that. She's flying. As chief of this village, I can't leave my people, so I must place the search in your capable hands. I pray that Zelda will return to us soon. Okay. Bye bye. Okay, Brandon, go ahead and warp us. Close to it, at least. So that star right there, no, down right, that star right there will, is the map. That's the tower. So if you want to warp close to there and do that, you, you can. You can do that, and then probably after the tower, if just fly to the... Objective. To the thingamajig. To the, once Brandon gets Bye -bye. to the objective, we'll call it an episode. I think the episode should end when Brandon gets the tower. And then Johanna is going to do geoglyphs. She's going to hit a geoglyph on the way, isn't she? There's a, there's yeah. a, a geoglyph in that same region. And then it's going to take us to uh, a new one that spawns. I feel bad for Paya. Everyone's all about Pura right now. Oh, so there's only two geoglyphs net left? Yeah. Paya is taking over for Impa. Yeah, so Johanna and I went out of our way. South. We went to the. Uh, yeah, if you want to click edit, I just wanted to put a little thingy on the on the mini map. Yeah, just click edit and then make it any of those colored ones, and I'll be on the mini map. Cool. Johanna and I went ahead and just went into the lost, um, the forgotten temple, yeah. and went to the back because it shows you a map of all of their locations and. So that's the last, the, the one on the map that Johanna's going to do is the last one, and then the game spawns one final one after that. So. Okay. Oh no! Oh no! It's running out of oh, towers, no, 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 no. running out of geoglyphs, running out of kogas. We're getting close to the end of the game. If you guys don't care about the village stuff, we might be able to power through and... It change. depends where we are in... Hold on. 1500 episodes. 12 episodes. <laughs> Because after, after Johanna does the two, um, 
geoglyphs. She's gonna be helping you guys work your way to the spirit temple. Okay. Cause she actually did did things out of order, and she did it way earlier than I did. I found it by accident. She found it by accident and just did it. Cool. Hey, I know you guys think you're you're all slick and stuff. Any green ones here? No, just the black one. Just this one. I need tails from green ones. Then I'll see you guys later. I see you later. I've got bigger fish to fry, literally. Ooh. This is Can sweet. you mark him on the map with the sword, please? Just click A where you're at. It's like right here. Yeah, and then put a sword. Because I, I get the feeling you don't want to mess with them right now, so. It's not right now. I'm, I'm jamming through. I've got an objective, you see? Oh, uh, the, bl the blood moon's coming. <sighs> the Gia? Right. Oh. Is he faster than me? Oh, no. Nah, they're pretty really. quick. I don't even see. The, oh, rock in my face! I don't even see the lights to the tower. It's because it's way up on the hill. Okay. That's why I keep trying to go up. Leave me alone, dude. You know, if you're ever bored of walking, feel free to spawn the the air bike. It's fun. Oh, it's true. I'm about the air bike, but I'm gonna get. Tyler said we can make 600 bikes. It get... costs nine to make because it's only three parts, oh, and I've got six hundred zonite to make it with. Is he done chasing me? Because now I'll spawn a bike. Yeah, he's done. I might roll down the hill. Yeah, I was gonna say. Is it's it's the very top option. Put it like right here, just so it doesn't roll. There we go. Very nice. Let's see if you can fly this thing better than I can. I mean, I'm gonna fly it right into a rock right now. No, you're not. Oh shoot, you can go like almost straight up with this yeah, thing. Yeah, you can go straight up. But where's the tower? What? I thought it was over here. What did I mark? I marked something over here. Yeah, because this isn't the tower. <laughs> Open up the map. Oh, oh it's over there's there. the tower. It's over there. Ah. This is off a little bit. Oh, but that's a different area. Because, see, that's on the other Because that's on this side. Well, you might as well get it. Yeah. Just get it. I can get yeah. the other one if need be. Yeah, you know what? In the next episode. Johanna will do something. See ya. Some stuff. Glyphs, right? Let Brandon get this tower off camera.